Now, does that have your attention? No? <laughs> well, okay then. All right. One thing. How about now? Don't know. But I mean, understand, but that was... I don't know what happened. I mean, it didn't fire as I thought it would. Be right back. All right. How about now? Still not convinced? Alright. Oh, there we go. Do I have your attention now? Alright. So, let's get into the mods. Hey guys, Trey is here with another video for you today, and today we're back in Bone Lab, of course, some brand new awesome mods. Um, so, welcome to Boba Corp's uh, ship way, ship, shipment way, ship way, whatever it's called. As you can see, it's a pretty freaking massive map that Bob Corp's been working on because he's Bob Corp. <laughs> But uh, yeah, let's just go ahead and jump right into these mods. Uh, so before I get to you, uh, don't worry, we will get into the mod I just showed off earlier, a second ago at the start of the video. We'll get into that. You'll see all the crazy shenanigans we can do with that mod. But let's get into the other mods that I have planned to show off today. I did. I was going to go and get a couple more, but uh, then I started using the main mod of today's video. And, and let's just say it takes center stage compared to the other mods I was going to get. But we'll put those in the next video. So let's just hop into it. Today we're starting off with uh, Drax's um, Cod Pack. Um, it, it, what, what more can I say? I mean, <laughs> I don't know. I'm guessing this is part of his uh, April Fast! joke of, uh, well, April Fool's joke, obviously, so, you know. So let's, uh, let's see what we can do with the, uh, COD pack. Let's go over here and talk to our friend Ford. Hey, Ford. What's up, buddy? Did, did that hurt? Did, did the, did the COD pack hurt, man? Yeah, I guess it did hurt. So it makes a, uh, sound, so, yeah. <laughs> Bonk, indeed. Yeah, it's a, it's, it's COD. <laughs> Up next is the customizable MK18. Pretty cool to see this mod finally get uh, brought back from Boneworks. It's been a minute. I remember they made a yellow one and a red and a red one, and eventually a blue one. So now we got it in a Bone Lab. So what we can do with this: you grab on the back and then press the menu button. You can go ahead and add a bunch of things. You know, just go crazy with it. Make it, uh, break it. Break, you know, do, do just something crazy. It's kind of hard to see the, uh, what the heck is the gravity welder? Uh, oh. What the heck? I don't remember this. Oh. It's like, uh, it's like a gravity gun, but it actually functions, is the case. And yes, of course, it does, you know, shoot. So, don't have to worry about that. Do a, you know, nice clean reload. I want to get this. I'm thinking it grab the bullets, but can it grab? Oh, no. Uh, didn't mean to grab that. <laughs> Let me just try that again. Yeah, you can grab the mag out of the air and you can do like a, you know, needle burrito reload or something. I'm sure you can come up with some trick reloads with this one. But yeah, that is the fully customizable MK18. So up next is another cool mod. This is the uh, trip mine. Looks very nice. Definitely reminds me of the. Uh, gravity cup thing which rarely anyone uses but uh, yeah they made a trip mine out of it so I'm guessing you just I don't want to face me with it huh that's strange 
something not working. Oh, there it is. <laughs> As you can see, it's a laser. Huh. I wonder how well this works. Uh, Ford, uh, test this, test this bomb for me, please. Ford, can you, yeah, can you test this bomb for me? Hold on. All right, Ford, test the bomb. Yeah, yeah, oh. Oh. I went pretty far up. I just saw it shimmer. Is it gonna come back down? Huh. Well, that's that. <laughs> Don't think it's gonna come down anytime soon. Uh, let's just go ahead and spawn another one in. Let's see what we can deal with it. Okay. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. Right? Okay, that's a neat, oh look at that, that is a neat and very dumb way to get around. Yeah, I can definitely see this map being used in very different videos, very different ways. I can do a lot of this map, like look how massive this map is, crazy. But yeah, this could be used as a traveling device, very, um, not, um, what's the word I'm looking for when something isn't very, like, not convenient. Just like not recommend it. Unorthodox. A very unorthodox way of travel. Or was it another word? Either way. <laughs> Either way, super fun, but we aren't just here to mess with those. Alright, so to get to the main event, guys. Right after we explore the course, new map. <laughs> Don't worry, I'm not gonna explore this whole map. I'll leave that to the rest of y'all. Don't forget, you can leave at any time. Okay. Let's sit in this chair. Why does no one add a suitable chair mod? Like, I don't mean just like a separate chair mod, I mean an actual, like, this just allows you to sit in any chair mod. <laughs> I, I, I don't understand it. I know there's like many different chair mods, but, like, come on. This is crazy. I don't like the creepy ambiance. Like, just, it doesn't even sound like wind. It, it just, it's just ambiance, man. It's just weird music, I think. Alright, so as you can see here, I got a very standard, uh... What was this? Was this the Makarov? I think this is the Makarov. As you see, a very standard issue Makarov that, uh... You know, fires, um... Sorry, caliber of bullet. <laughs> Very nice. Very interesting. But in all seriousness, um, yeah, pretty much this is the mod I've been waiting for for a long while for someone to make. This is as close as we're gonna get as the uh, you can literally fire anything mod out of any gun mod. <laughs> pretty much firing any object, well, not object, but any type of caliber of bullet out of any gun, almost. Say almost because it's pretty difficult to get some of these to actually load. For example, I can uh, just go ahead and load this on up with, uh, I don't know. It actually, looks like it fits <laughs> with this um, MP9. That fires now um, a freaking 5.7 caliber bullet. <laughs> Like, that's crazy to think about, man. Or you can, I don't know, go ahead and grab a uh, P90 and, I don't know, put that into an MP. 
MP9 and in... No? <laughs> Crazy. So yeah, this is Rex's newest mod. He decided to finally dabble in some code mods and luck where he's got us. We're able to finally fire any bullet from any gun. I wonder. Ooh. So now we can fire a shotgun shell. No, not from you. From a sniper rifle. That's insane. Who would have thought? And it actually, actually has spread too. Look at this. Look at those multiple spread shots. It's crazy. You can actually fire pocket shells from a sniper rifle. Like, who would have thought that? Who would have ever thought that would be, you know, possible? Oh, hold on. Just gotta attack, reload this thing. There we go. Ah. Uh, must not have loaded. Oh, well. And of course, we can do the opposite. Like, I don't know. Fire a sniper round from a, mach a machine gun? Like, who would have who, who thought of this? Like, what? High caliber sniper round from a machine gun. Like, that's, that's crazy. It's like some type of wonder weapon intervention or something. And of course, we can do the most ridiculous of things. And fire a freaking Springfield sniper rifle bullet from a machine gun. Now you can see what it felt like to fire, you know, a flintlock from a. <laughs> well, pretty much how I felt to load a flintlock. I mean, it's still maybe like 45% faster, but, you know. Look at that. <laughs> and then. Look at that, that's crazy. Yeah, and that's it. You, you can't, you can't, for some reason you can't chamber it again. It's literally one and done. <laughs> like, what, what? I can only fire the thing once. <laughs> Why? Oh man, but we can uh, up the ante a little bit, you know, maybe fire a machine gun. Shotgun. What does that sound? A machine gun? Shotgun. Like, that's crazy. That is truly, truly insane to think about. <laughs> or, to go up to the ante a little bit more. Maybe you want to be a little bit more low key, more compact, and just bring the true name to a submachine gun. And yeah, just straight up fire a submachine gun filled to the rim of the uh, magazine. What was I saying? Sorry, I was having too much fun firing a machine gun magazine out of a submachine gun. Now, of course, you could do, you know, crazier and crazier things like. You know, load a shotgun shell into a freaking sniper rifle, you know? Like, why not? <laughs> Rob, of course, seems to have enjoyed doing that. Oh. Okay, I don't know what happened there. Kind of just dejected. A little bit finicky, these things are. Just a little bit. But. They still and you have to right I forgot you have to chamber it again but you know it works sure you have to load it one at a time but you know as long as you know what you're 
doing? You know, I don't see no problem. You know, firing, loading, three. Look at that, they all fit in there all snug as a bug in a rug. No, I have no idea where the hell went. Oh, there you are. I guess not. Well, for some reason, the first one ejected them. Not, I don't know what happened, but <laughs> it happens. Hmm. But yeah, this is all hate stuff. You know, this is all very rudimentary compared to what I'm about to show you guys. You're about to show, or show, you're about to see true, true degeneracy at work here. Let me just show you. We are about to create some true madness, ladies and gentlemen. These are about to be the truest definition of the word wonder weapons, because we're about to do some heresy up in here. So let's start off with, I don't know, I guess the first intro weapon, the Apophagan Servants. Now we can go ahead, take this immense power, just, you know, just really, just really jam it into this gun. Hopefully. I mean, I have tested this a few times, but it won't always go as planned. Ah! But most of the time, it will. And the results are, well... <laughs> Insane, to say the least. So yeah, it's just one of the many crazy weapons you can just, you know, throw together. Maybe I'll get a little bit of crazier and just try to get a Mustang and Sally to shoot the acid gat. You know. <laughs> Look at that! It makes zero sense. But it works so freaking well. Wouldn't you agree? <laughs> or maybe we can just, I don't know, get the, um, let's say the scavenger magazine and, ah, uh, the slick with fire. Just jam that on top, like so. Pull the doohickey and just, oh wow, look at that. Nice little explosion. Oh, out of ammo already. Crazy. And of course you can combine this with other mods to create yourself some infinite ammo so you can just keep firing these things forever if you want. I will not be linking those mods because I am lazy. <laughs> Why don't we try something a little bit more... I don't know, Mustang and Sally. Bullet into the scavenger and uh, that's, that's crazy, crazy stuff. I, I think we can go a little bit crazier. They put it in the ray gun, huh? No, you know it work. Oh no, there it is. <laughs> oh, that is. Absolutely incredible. Man, imagine all the crazy things you can do with all this stuff. All the crazy weapon combinations. So yeah, as you can clearly see, this doesn't just work with Rex's weapon pack. It works with all the guns in the game. <laughs> obviously, so you can just go crazy. Make some really interesting weapons, you know? Let's see. Like I said, it's not going to be easy. But it, it does work. Occasionally. <laughs> uh, of course, last but certainly not least, the freaking Wunderwaffe. Just, you know, 
jam this in there. There, there you go. Then just no, 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 no. Just turn it on and off. Oh. Right. This doesn't seem to be doing much, but you know, it does something, I suppose. There you go. But yeah, some truly interesting stuff, guys. So, yeah, hope you all enjoyed this video. It's gonna be some crazy couple of days. Creating some very wacky out of this world weaponry. Like, I mean, obviously, you can combine, again, all these weapons with one another. Create some crazy combination with other mods, even crazier combinations that could probably crash the game. Uh, and yes, you can load the revolver as well with some ammo types. I haven't been able to get certain things working, but you know, still an amazing mod. You have yeah, outdone yourself again, Rex. I was not expecting all things this like crazy. I could just load M nineteen eleven Mustang with the slicker fire fire slicker fire shots. Now the big question is, what to use for my thumbnail? Anyways, I'll see y'all in the next video. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, go ahead and leave a like. Comment down below. If you'd like to see me do more, you know, videos on in the near future. And as always, want to support me, you know, keep the channel alive, keep going. Support me down on uh, Patreon down below in the description. And as always, remember to leave a like, subscribe, check us stuff back, and enjoy life. I'll see y'all in the next video, guys. All right, peace.